Hey there everyone, Derek Hayes here. Welcome back to another day of No Man's Sky. So today, we're gonna do something a little bit different. We're gonna take the main story quest and we're gonna push it to the back seat. We're gonna take a break from it for a little bit. And we are going to look for a home. We're gonna look for a base. Uh, hyperdrive has no fuel. Okay, so that's a problem. <laughs> So let's get some hyperdrive fuel first, and then we are going to find a place to call our very own to uh, make our base on and build it up. Because I've been hyper focused in on the story, thinking at some point the story is going to be like, okay, here you are, here's the game, go nuts. And I have been informed that that is not the case. <laughs> so let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to actually pull up. Um, I'm out of launch thrusters, so that's fantastic. I need hyperdrive. That's a cadmium drive. Hyperdrive, and I don't have a warp cell. Okay, so we have some minor problems here. I don't really need that. Someone actually also mentioned I had something in my inventory that I wasn't actually using. Um, yeah, this movement system. Is this not attached? I move this to tech? I don't know what I'd do with that. Either way, we don't need the mine arc. Mind arc. We need a warp cell. So I have antimatter. I just need antimatter housing. And what does that take? Oxygen and ferrite dust. Let me just go see if I can buy it. I'm just gonna be lazy. There we go. Let me in. Bingo. Okay. Now. I just combine you two together. Oh, come on, I ran out of room. Did I really run out of space? How did I run out of space? Oh, it's because it's on a starship. Give me the exosuit. Um, yeah, give me another warp cell. Put that bad boy on the starship. Combine you. Congratulations, I now have two. Now, what do you need? I need starship fuel. I wonder if I can just buy uranium. Is that a thing? Can I just buy the uranium? I know I can't get hydrogen here for whatever freaking reason. Um, Ion battery. That'd be sweet if I could actually put that into my ship. But no. No, I cannot. So that is absolutely infuriating. God, can I even leave this place then? There's a warp cell. Did that just take up both of those? Holy shit, that did not actually give me any. <laughs> that did not give me any fuel. That's two of them. I probably should have done that on a bigger scale. Looking back, that probably would have been smart of me. At least I can take off from here, so that's a plus. Okay, it's it's a little awkward to fly around. But I need to go somewhere within range. We got the uh, Gigarna Lilar. Damn, this is a big one. That is a big... I like that star. It's green. Can I go to this giant... Um, nope, I need an Emerald Drive. I do not have that. So let's go to Zuanam's blah blah blah. Can I get some details on it? You no, know, expand. Economy, data unavailable. Conflict, data unavailable. What about you? Yeah, it doesn't It doesn't really tell me. So that's unfortunate. Where do I want to go? Should I go to this Viking one? Uh, region C of Etones. Etones. It's got a few planets. All right, let's go to this one. We'll check it out. I mean, I, I'm wondering if there's an easier way to scope out planets rather than just literally doing it the old-fashioned way of flying to it and taking a gander. We de we need... Uh, I was told I need copper, and I definitely like a temperate planet. I don't want to have to worry about cold or heat. So, cross our fingers. Oh, shit. What do we got here? Warp five times. Oh, hey, 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 hey. We need battle detected. Holy shit. Hold on. Rescue the freighters. Attack ship six. Okay, we're rescuing the freighters. You're going down, punk. See ya. Who else we got? Who else we got? 
Yeah. Six on one, you guys don't stand a chance. Okay, where's he at now? Out of range. Well, let's go within range. Uh, okay, escape is possible. I ain't escaping. We're helping these homies out. I don't know who's attacking him, but we're gonna ruin their day. Watch, these are the good guys. The freighters are the bad guys. It's like a giant slave trade ring, and these are the good guys trying to help out their friends. And I'm just shooting them down. Um, okay, we got... How many more do we got? We got two more to go. Okay. Damn, that is sick. They're lasering them and everything. Hold on. Let me take you out. Thank you. Ooh, you know what I need to do? Actually, as I'm thinking about this and shooting down other uh, other ships, is I need to sell the clunkers that I have. Cool. Uh, emergency comms established. Incoming message. Well, let me answer it. What's up? Um, interloper, Viking, blah, 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 request. I don't know what you're saying to me, dude. The life form must be the captain of this freighter. Looks greatly relieved. They gesture as if to welcome me aboard their vessel. Okay, cool. Let's go. Which one, though? Oh, this one. This thing is a monstrosity. Holy crap. What the hell is that? Oh, it's just an asteroid. It just looked weird. Cargo pod. Okay, how do I get in here? Oh, shit. Nope. We hit it. We hit it. Initiate docking procedure. Press escape to read more. Oh, I'm about to crash. Okay, um, guide? Not combat. Getting around. I don't see anything about docking procedures. You're a liar, game. Well, that was pretty easy. I don't, I honestly don't know what I did there. Okay, now what are we doing? Uh, I need to go up there, apparently, and talk to the captain. How do I get me one of these? Like, for real, like... Freaking giant ship. Can I just buy this? Yo, dude, I got like, almost a million credits. I've saved it all up for my allowance, and can I buy your ship with that, please? I'm sure you'll happily just hand it over to me, right? Dude, this is sick. This is freaking awesome. Look at this thing. What's up, Home Slice? What's up, Admiral? Boy, interloper. Yeah, man, I, I don't get what you're saying to me at all. The alien barks a loud battle cry as I approach. Celebrating our victory, I hope. They gesture towards the control panel on their freighter as to, as if to suggest I take command. Uh, what? What? They're just giving me the ship? It's a C-class freighter. I guess I'm fine with that. Oh no. They couldn't give me a B-class? What's thing? It's... Okay. What? Is this for real? Did they just give me the ship? Freighter fleets. Owning a freighter brings several de benefits, including a portable base, a very large inventory, and the ability to command fleets of frigates. Freighters offer extra inventory storage. Additional starships can be docked in the freighter's hangar. Command expeditions from the bridge. Construct a base aboard the freighter. Why do I need a home planet if I just got a giant spaceship? Holy crap. Okay. Inspect my fleet. Yes, sir. 
I will gladly do that. I don't know. Hey, you're a sucker, man. I was going to at least pay you a million credits. Ha, got you good. Um, okay. I have a fleet? I have one. I, I have a ship. Damn, we have a combat rating and everything? Okay, okay. Why have I been doing the main story when all I had to do to start getting cool stuff was ignore the main story? Um, this is freaking awesome. Okay, so what do we got going on? It's got a combat rating. It's an in interstellar frigate. Um, fuel requirements. I don't know what any of this means. Okay, so that's my frigate list. Speak with the freighter's navigator. What's up, Mr. Navigator? I know I don't speak your language. Apparently now I do. Our ship lacks a fleet command room. We cannot possibly dispatch expeditions in this state. Well, how do... Navigator Bootzon has prepared an expedition for my fleet, but my freighter lacks the fleet command room I need to maintain communications during the voyage. Build a base inside your freighter. The construction area is located between the hangar and the bridge. Well, okay, there it goes. I was like, what the heck? Okay, so freighter parts. I need, uh, is it a fleet command room? It's gotta be a fleet command room. Damn, where do I put this thing? Ooh, I can put it right there. Oh, I see now. Okay, I can't put it there. There's a, there's a, there's a height restriction of this one. This one's only for short people, okay? So I'll, I'll have to hold off until I get short people. Damn, I got what I need too. Oh, it's conveniently what's in the inventory. Press P to read more. Making money. Now we're talking. Command of a large capital ship offers several benefits. High among these is the ability to command a fleet of frigates. Find and purchase frigates to add them to your fleet. Recruitable frigates in a freighter group will be marked with an icon. Now approach a recruitable frigate and speak with them on the starship communicator. There are several types of frigate, and each individual ship varies in quality while not on expeditions. While not on expeditions, frigates will, per will perform tasks related to their abilities. Land on a frigate to collect rewards from these tasks. Trade fig frigates will accumulate wealth. Science will provide scans to ancient artifacts. Supply ships will generate fuel. And mining vessels will collect minerals. Combat ships will come to your aid if you fight nearby pirates. Cool. I would assume this one is a pirate ship. Or a combat ship. A pirate ship. Gar, matey. Okay. So we got fleet command. Calibrating command post a new master signature. Success. Master profile indicates one support frigate available. Profile indicates no frigate fuel blueprints available. Download. Yeah, download that bad boy. Oh, it's always dihydrogen. <laughs> okay, a small barrel of frigate fuel. This viscous gel is highly toxic to the touch. A refined fuel that powers the interstellar engines. Yada, 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 yada. Okay. So I got a blueprint. And I got some fuel. No expedi expedition assigned. Fleet command standing by. Cool. So I just had to build this and now I can go talk to old, old what's-his-face over here, Smiley. And he will send us on an expedition. Gra! Uh, this is a fresh glory available for the fleet. I have charted new expedition routes. Prepare for triumph. Alright, well let's check them out. So we got a combat patrol. We got a balanced expedition. So what, what's my rewards here? We got a trade expedition for money, a voyage of discovery, difficulty rating, one star. Industrial. Okay. This takes one hour. This one takes 59 minutes. Damn, these actually take real, real hours. Should we do a combat patrol? What's my rewards? Um, what is this? It's an interstellar frigate. It's got combat abilities. Pay back. I got... What do I get for this, though? I think that's the big thing, is what, what do I actually get for this? What do I... Ooh, okay. Don't know what that does. 50 tons of fuel? Gemini. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What do we go back? So I think it said that this is a balanced one. I'd really like to send, like, what do you give me? I guess let's do this. It's a two-star rating. I don't think we have any other ships. 
we don't. Fleet rating, difficulty rating. Okay, it's a one star. We probably shouldn't do that. Oh, that one's two. Maybe a voyage, adventures in the space beyond, a metal mining exploration, uh, final stop, vigil for modal, conducting constructive opportunities. I don't think that it does it matter. Like for re like honestly, does this matter? Do I need to do the voyage of discovery since it's a fleet rating of one and I have or the difficulty rating of one and I have a fleet rating of one? I don't know. I, I don't know. Let's just do the let's do the balanced one. And see what happens. I mean, worst case scenario, my ship blows up. Now you're the admiral. I need to. Uh, the ship's former owner has vi visibly relaxed. They seem to revel in their unworried return to pure freighter captaincy, to the simple life of engines, route plotting, and cargo. I'm heartened the sail has not prompted them to immediately flee the vessel. Um, yeah, can we? Tr oh, we can transfer stuff. Sick. Okay, so we got freighter inventory. This thing needs um, stuff in the warp drive. Damn, we got chromatic metal for days. We got some gold. What else? We, let's put the storm crystals over. That stuff. Um, yeah, let's just let's put everything over. I'm gonna hold on to the tritium though. Greetings, interloper, Captain. The expedition has covered 234 light years, and I estimate our plotted route will take a further two hours, 32 minutes, and eight seconds. All systems nominal. Let's inspect the ships. Looks good, bud. Great job. Killing it. Okay, now what? Do I just gotta wait for it to be done? I guess let's go hop in our ship and then we can go around and look at the planets that's nearby. I don't. Does this thing follow us? I'm not really 100% sure what's going on with this freighter. I'm imagining that I actually probably need to get hyperdrive fuel for it and that I can jump with it. And then I get out into this ship and this is this is what I use to explore planets would be would be my guess so let's go ahead and scan that it's a spined planet I don't like the sound of that what is this monstrosity though scanner recharging it doesn't look pretty it honestly looks kind of hideous a fiery planet oh no 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 I do not want to get stuck in there it's got selenium copper and phosphorus can I just get like a nice relaxing like I know I've talked about beach planet before. What about a forest? Huh? Let's go check out the uh what's this one? The spined. Since that sounds so appealing. I kinda dig it. Like are those trees? What are you? Oh, an extreme sentinel planet? Yeah, we do we do not want to be building on an extreme sentinel planet, that's for sure. Ooh, we got dihydrogen though. I need dihydrogen for freaking days. You know what I really need to build is I need to build my advanced mining laser. Um, the fact that I haven't built that yet is a little bit embarrassing. Just kind of like the fact that I haven't actually built a good base yet is also a lot of embarrassing. Okay, I'm going to get... I'm just going to collect... Yeah, I can't get that big one. I want to get the big one. What's that take? I, mean, I need a hermetic seal and carbon nanotubes. I don't think I can actually build either of those. I can make the carbon nanotubes. That's actually not that bad. Oh! Well, never mind. Yes, I can. Well, that's a pain in the butt. Let me actually... Mm, let's ditch the hexaberries. Let's grab these, uh, grab these balls. Yo, what's up, dude? Yeah, what are you, hey, hey, hey. Chill out, dude. I'm just stealing these Gravitino balls. I don't know what you're so angry about. Oh, shit. Ooh, that hurt. Yeah, they're searching for me. Let them search, and nerds. Okay. So what are these things like? Worth? Ah, eh, they're worth. They're worth. They're worth a little bit. Um, let's put this in the starship. I think that's a good place to store that. And then let me make this hermetic seal, and then the multi-tool. All this trouble just for an advanced mining laser. Cool. Also, I can get some more hydrogen. Oh yeah, they're looking for me. But they didn't find me. Ooh, we got some more of these balls over here, too. I don't know what these things do, but 
I meant okay, hold on, hold on. Supersymmetric particle cluster, extremely rare and valuable. A product of divergent super gravitational forces. Upgrading and trading. Cool, I'm just gonna keep collecting them, then I'll I don't know, do do something else with them. Nope. I don't care about the dihydrogen. Give me the ball. Oh, yeah, 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 there it was. They're searching for me. I ain't scared. Oh, they're screaming. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, shit, that's a robot. Bail. <laughs> Go ahead, throw that bad boy in there. Cool. And we're outie. Wait, what is this? Damn, what is this? Holy crap! Oh god, what do you want? Where'd that sentinel go? Go away, you little shit. I ain't bothering anything. Okay, we can search this. Ah, oh, my inventory's full. What is this thing, though? Okay. A terminal blanks awaiting input. Download the data. Subroutine Sentinel. Dispatch to intervene in life form. Blank war. Removal from history. Continuation of creator protocols. Sentinels eradicate species. Do not return. Diagnostic, yada, yada, yada. Analysis. Continues to express original program directives, growing its ability to model conflict scenarios. Redundant behavior, data loss troubling, potential loss of control. Self-awareness? What'd you just... What? What is this thing? Like, I'm awfully confused. Can I, like... What happens if I go through it? 1.0 souls on extreme worlds. Cool, thanks game. Still have no idea what this giant thing is. Damn, we only get we get four launches out of our fuel. That's that's just depressing. <laughs> we got our fleet command up there. What do we have here? So I think that was the fiery planet. What are you? You're red. You look really cool actually. From space anyway. Yeah, let me scan you. Scan is recharging. Can you do that quicker, please? Flourishing planet. Star bulb, copper, paraffinium, sodium, but it has aggressive sentinels. Screw the sentinels. What the hell's a flourishing planet? It does have aggressive sentinels, so I'm a little bit worried about that. Oh, superheated rainstorm approaching. Wait a minute, is this... Is this water? Does it have an ocean? It does have an ocean. What the hell's a superheated rainstorm, though? Yeah, this is probably not the right place. It's got some extreme weather conditions. It's got some angry sentinels, allegedly. Damn, it looks cool, though. Oh, shit. Let's see what's involved with a superheated rainstorm. Sentinels hateful. Dangerously hot fog. <laughs> oh my god, okay. I mean, we have it. Oh, I need to actually hold on. Hold on. I need to put some, uh. Put some oxygen in my life support. Yeah, it, it's a little harsh for me. By that I mean it's a lot of harsh for me. Yeah, it is. It is a hundred degrees Celsius, and I got a freaking sentinel following me already. Okay. 
It, it is it isn't our dream home. See you nerds. We actually got away. Ha! Got him. I, I think it's kind of funny that the Sentinels are actually afraid of the space stations. Kind of interesting. Very, very interesting. Yes, I am. Okay, let's go find let's go buy our uh our one inventory slot that we need. Okay, we got these Gravitino balls. I'm gonna hold on to them though. Just kinda like the storm crystals. I feel like they're actually worth something. I just don't know what. Did I move them over here? I moved the storm crystal. I could have sworn I got a lot more than these. Whatever. Um, okay. Honestly, I think we're gonna call it here, folks. We're still on the search for our uh, our home sweet home. We found a nice uh, little freighter RV thing to help us get to our home sweet home, but all the planets we saw in the system were not fantastic. So I'm going to call it, and we're going to be on the search again next time. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit that thumbs up button if you did. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see what happens next on No Man's Sky. I hope everyone has a fantastic day. Check you later.